three. Okay. Praise the Lord. Thank you for joining us. Today, our, our key is going to be uh, not like uh, yesterday we talked about worry, so today we're going to talk about the spiritual key. We're going to talk about fear. And sometimes the spiritual key has to do with things that come between us or has the potential to come between us and God. And we have to use that key so that we'll have a place to put it. The idea about fear is fear wants us to always look at something temporary, a temporary circumstance, a temporary situation, something temporary. Fear always wants us to be distracted from what is important. Fear always wants us to react to what we think we see rather than what we know. So today, when we have fear, now fear can also be a positive thing because it can propel us to do things and propel us to try things, but let's make sure that we don't let fear be in front of us leading the way, but fear always be behind us, always be away from us, and never come between us and our God. So when we have fear come into our lives, let's make sure we put it away because what? God did not give us a spirit of fear. God did not give us a spirit of fear. He gave us a spirit of faith. He gave us a spirit of joy. He gave us a spirit of hope. He gave us a spirit of Him so that we can see and experience Him. So today, we understand that when we have this key called fear, it is to lock it away. Put it out, put it away, and see to it that it doesn't come between us and our God and our destiny and our purpose. So thank you again for joining us. Thank you for listening. Remember, our spiritual key chains, and as we go forward, we're going to have more spiritual keys next week. So God bless you. Thank you for listening. We'll see you next time.